Oh, there you are. Oh. Yes. Oh, now, very impressive. Thank you. May I say, the choice of lime in particular is very slimming. You're too kind. Well, I must be off. Uh, mm. Didn't I have an appointment, Lupo? What? Oh, yeah. the publisher. That was it. I must see how my new book is doing. Oh, you're a writer. Well, yes, I've been known to scribble a bit. Oh, bravo. My master's a famous writer of love and how to please ladies. You've heard of Bernardo Guardi. Lupo, hush. But he's a friend. Sir. I'm so sorry. Bernardo Guardi? I'm sorry. I can't believe it. Allow me to interrupt it. I'm so sorry. I didn't mean to. You, sir, are Bernardo Guardi. It's my nom de plume, but you must swear to tell no one. I swear, on my honour, sir, my solemn vow. Bernardo Guardi. Fulvio, this all needs some thinking about. Yes, it does. It's my great honour, sir. Look at me. I am. Oh, dear, Master Guardi. Take me under your tutelage, I beg you. I'll pay you handsomely, whatever you like. I'll pay it. You want me to tutor you? I want you to transform me. Transform me. Oh, my dear man, but you have but an hour until you must meet her. I'm not going. I don't want to go. You can't make me go. Look, as it happens, my new book, which isn't out yet, deals with the outer man. You see, the relation between the physical and the spiritual is little understood. Except by me, of course. Master Aquati. Yes. Can you... Yes, I can. Oh, God. But it will take courage. Courage, yes. Do you understand me? I understand. Welcome. Where's Francesca? My name is Pietro Papriccio and I'm from Genoa. Signor Fabrizio of Genoa. Signor Papriccio. From Genoa? <laughs> uh, is your name... Uh, Bruni. <sighs> Signora Bruni, your daughter has been duped by none other than Casanova. But worry not. This is good. <laughs> Why don't you stop interfering? What? <coughs> Thank you. <coughs> oh. oh dear. Oh dear. <coughs> 